Ah, oh, so that's good to note. Just going around a circle. But yeah, that's good to note now. Crap. I think I've already been over here. So we gotta wait a couple more rounds before we can come back to the witch's house. I need to get quick revive from the witch's ASAP. I can buy stamina up while I'm down here. If I can find my way. Okay, I haven't went this way yet. So it has to be this way. Yeah, this is definitely the way. Oops, wrong button. Had to make sure I didn't blow myself up. And there we go. Okay. How much is stamina up? 2,000? Yeah, I'll have enough. Nice. Okay, so we got stamina up now. So we know we won't get that from the witches. And now we got the cause refibrillator. How do you say that? Cause refib refib refibrillator. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah, the cause refibrillator. That's so hard to say. Why can't they just call it upgrade ballistic knife? That would be a better name to say. At least I know how to say that. Or call it, like, only use me blade or something. I don't know. Something easy to say. Instead of the stupid cause refibrillator. Okay. Oh, crap. Don't know why I'm trying to kill them. Alright, took all my points. What else are you going to take? My weapons? That would suck if you got hit from the witches that they took your weapons. That would suck. Okay. I want to see how good this thing is. I've never upgraded the ballistic knives. So let's see how good these do. Wait, before we do that... Um, is the booze in here? Yes, it is. I will open up Voltraid so I can buy Voltraid before the um, next time I go in the witch's house. Just so I can have four perks and I know I will not get um, Voltraid and Stamina Up and Mule Kick and Jug from the witches. I could get Quick Revive, Speed Cola, or Double Tap. I just want to go ahead and open up this. Move out of the way. Oh, it's a one, um, shot. Okay, so this may actually be pretty good. It's a one shot right now. This is risky. I just wanted to go in there because I heard the sound. Don't ask me why. How much is ammo for this? 500, okay. I might need to buy ammo before I go into the witches again. Once again, I only have the B23 so I can kill the witches easily. Yeah, this isn't one melee on him. On them. So that's good. And it sounds pretty awesome too whenever you shoot it. Okay. I don't want to get trapped. How much ammo do I get in it? Nine bullets? Not too bad, I guess. I, mean, I can constantly um, get the bullets back. So it's not too bad. Okay, here's some more spawning. Okay. Crap. Why am I coming over here? Crap, I missed. That was a fail. Once I get Voltraid on this, though, I should 
um, I should be a lot better with it. Like, I should have, like, unlimited ammo, pretty much. Don't think it'd be that good, but still. One thing, though, it is hard to pick up the um, blades after you shoot it. Especially while you got a lot of zombies chasing you. Here's another blade. Go and pick that up. Yeah, I love how you don't have to press F on them now. You could just walk up and grab it. Okay, I believe this is it. I got enough for Vulture Aid now. Which is good. Just go ahead and go buy that puck. Buy some of that Vulture Aid. Wow. You run so fast with this. Especially with stamina up. Vulture Aid is 3,000 though. When it first came out I thought it was only 2,000. Okay, nice. So I should be able to get ammo for this gun constantly. Which is good. And there's two windows back here? thought there was only one. This would be a good camp spot if there was only... Or there was no windows back here. It would be a good camp spot. And there's another window right there. I think they spawn up upstairs too. So they spawn pretty much everywhere. Okay, we just need to try and stay alive until the next round of the witches. Go kill any zombies you see. I don't think he killed any. I love knifing Leroy into the zombies. So funny. And even if they are injured, they'll come back fully health um, if you... I forgot that was the last zombie. Um... But yeah, if you um, if a zombie's damaged or a crawler, you can shoot Leroy into him, and he'll just respawn as a fully healed zombie, which is good to know. Especially if you want to try and save a zombie, just have Leroy run into him real quick. Oh crap. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh my gosh, that was so close. Thought I was dead. Crap, I did not want to be in the Vulture Aid stink. Oh crap, this train is messy. This train is very messy. Okay, so I think my new goal is round 15. I think that would be pretty good. This is still one knife. It is going to be a lot tougher once this becomes two knives. And while I'm backing up, I cannot miss the stairs. If I do, then it's just game over because I'm backed into a corner. And sadly, with melee, you can't get yourself out of a corner very easily. But this part is pretty easy to train, if you do what I do, but the only problem I have with it is it's hard to group them up at the start of a round. Oh crap, that was close. Yeah, it's hard to group them up in um, a train in the beginning of a round. But once you get the first wave in there, it's pretty easy to train them. If you do what I do. In fact, this is the only, this is the first time I've ever tried this train. But it's actually working pretty good. This is no longer one shot, which kind of sucks. But at least I could buy or pick up ammo for it. That's good. Okay, this is the last round that the Garvinuck was going to be a one knife now. Round 14. Speed colors up there. In case you guys did not know, you can see it with Vultrade. 
Oh crap, it's a two knife now. Thought it was a two knife um after round fourteen, but it's in round fourteen. Oh crap. This is really going to suck. It's a freaking two knife already. Come on, if I could just beat this round, I'll be happy. I just need to try and beat this round. I wish I still had my three quick revives. Because I'm actually doing good right now. I could knock on some wood, but I'm busy right now. So you guys can do it for me. Because I have a feeling I'm going to go down any minute. Okay. And this Voltre, I mean, not Voltre, but Ballistic Knife doesn't seem to kill anymore. See, they're not running very fast, and they really nearly trapped me. That wouldn't help. I'm going to try using this some. Um, if I could just shoot it and then walk it to the zombie, I should be able to pick it up. That was risky. I don't know why I tried to do that. I don't even think I picked it up either. Okay. Heard a zombie spawning in somewhere. Now we're way too far ahead of the zombies. Oh no. Crap. I'm trying to... Whoa! What the heck is going on? Okay, my keyboard just started messing up. I'm stuck. Great, thanks a lot, keyboard. Ugh. You survived 14 rounds, though. That's a pretty hard challenge. I may have to come back to that challenge also, as well as the war weapons only on Mob of the Dead. But anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.